Hi everyone, just want to give you a super quick tutorial on how to hide your IP address when you're browsing the internet. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is get yourself a secure VPN. Now there's a link to the exact one that I use in uh, the description and there's also some codes in there to get a free trial and also to get 20% off any of the paying products. I personally just uh, buy a yearly subscription every year because I use it all the time. So firstly, I'm going to go to Google and say, what, what is my IP address? So this will bring up my actual public IP address. Now I've blanked some of that out uh, just because it really is my current IP address. So then all you have to do is open up your secure VPN. Again, the exact one that I use is in uh, the description. So just click the link, it'll take you straight there. And then you can select any proxy server that you want to use. This is basically a server that's uh, going to communicate with the internet um, about where you are. For more information about uh, proxy servers and how they work, I'm going to be doing a much more in-depth video. So there should be a link in the description and also on your screen now to go and watch that video. So let's click this IP address here. So you can see it there. That's... Uh, our current proxy location. We'll open a new window, go to Google, oh, google.com, because we don't want Yahoo. So as you can see, it's taken us to Google UK instead of google.de, which is uh, Deutschland. Now the reason for that is because our proxy is active. So if I say now, what is my IP address? it's going to come up with this new one. Now, if you look at the IP that we selected, it matches exactly to what Google sees our IP address as being. So that's essentially all you need to do. From this, you can browse, you can download things, do whatever you want, and it's going to think your IP address is this proxy server located in the UK or whatever one you decide you want it to be. Now, another way you can go one step further is with this proxy active, you can actually use what's called the Tor browser. So this is a browser that will essentially bounce your IP address around the world to, I think, three or four different proxy servers before retrieving the information from whatever website it is you're visiting. Now, this is uh, obviously a little bit more advanced and it will make the load speeds a little bit slower, but it's just that extra layer of protection if you want to go that far. I personally normally don't because in my experience, the proxy that I use has worked perfectly fine, but it's totally up to you if you want to go down that road. So I encourage you to watch my more in-depth video, and that will explain to you exactly how the proxy that I use works and why it's secure. And I hope this has helped you.